Oh, wow, these takoyaki look so good. Over here, look at this, guys. Okay, awesome. Okay, I can't wait to try it out. So now you guys doing it? Hello, how's it going? Big crowd of people. So it must be delicious if you have a lot of people here. <laughs> Hello, welcome to another beautiful day here in Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia. So currently I'm at the Saturday street food market. So you know what time it is. It's time to get some street food. So as always, you know the drill, smash the like button, subscribe if you haven't already. Let's see how much our food over here and let's enjoy the vibes of Kuala Lumpur. All right, so here's the first street food of today. Actually, I'm kind of thirsty. So I'm gonna go for a delicious Malaysian drink. Hello. Hello, hi, how are you? Good, how are you? Abu Kaba. So I see you have so many different drinks over here. Yeah. What what do you recommend me? Because I'm very thirsty in Kuala Lumpur. Because you know Kuala Lumpur is very hot. Yes, you guys just enjoy Chandel. Chandel? Yeah, Chandel Patla. Let me see Chandel Patla real quick. Oh wow. Okay, can I have one cup please? Is this a popular drink here in Kuala Lumpur? Mm -hmm. Also in Malaysia, chendol is very famous, yes? Because I had chendol desserts before, but I haven't had a chendol drink before. Yeah. So first you're gonna put some syrup? Okay. Brown sugar. Brown sugar, all right. Yeah, you're putting some ice? Yes, I'm putting some ice. Okay. And then here's the chendo. So it's green and white. So, I, uh, so it's coconut. So it's coconut milk. Also, you put condensed milk too? No, okay. And then this is the chendo, right? The green, the green stuff over here. Look at this, guys. Okay, awesome. Okay, I can't wait to try it out. Exactly what that guy said. They was saying she's on TV. Huh? You're so friendly. <laughs> okay, Chendo. I need to shake it like this. Hey, you, you show me. Yeah, you shake it for me. This is, you're, you're the professional shaker. Okay, let me give it a try real quick, and then I'll pay you. Okay. okay. As always, Mr. Now, let's give this Chendo drink a uh, try. It's very sweet, very chewy, the chendol. And then some green chendol over here. Let me go off to the side a little bit. Chewy and sweet. So we have the sweetness from like the coconut milk. But I think also they put some condensed milk in too. I think earlier I saw some other vendor put some condensed milk. But yeah, it's very sweet and nice. The chendol, it's like little like green noodles, noodles, you see over here. Definitely give it a try in Kuala Lumpur. It's their specialty chendol. A lot of people were telling me try out chendol, try out chendol. I tried out the dessert before, but this is the drink, so definitely gonna try it out. Well, definitely trying it out right now. Very tasty. All right, and how much is this? Four ringgit. Only four ringgit? Yeah. Very good price. Such a beautiful Mal Malaysian lady. <laughs> so here you go. I think I have four ringgit in my pocket. Wow, look at this guy. So quick. Here you go. Thank you. you can count it for yourself. One, two. There we go. Teddy Makasi. Bye bye. I will definitely come back for uh, another street food. All right, awesome. Bye bye. Bye. All right, I found the second food of today, which is going to be takoyaki. So I'm over here at super big, big takoyaki here in Kuala Lumpur. Hello. Hello. Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum So check it out. This guy, he's famous over here for the super big takoyaki. Wow, looks amazing. So right now, all these are little squids, right? So why do you call this super big takoyaki? Because usually uh, takoyaki, yeah, uh, other takoyaki using like small part of it. Small part of the squid. Oh wow! Look at this guy. You can even see like the little like 
Ooh. Looks nice. He just he just started making it. Unfortunately, couldn't show us the whole process of him making it. Yeah. But wow, these takoyaki look so good. And at three for twelve ringgit, yeah. Takoyaki. Okay, this is Malaysian style takoyaki. They make it super big, big. <laughs> All right, can I actually get one order of this, please? Uh, which one would you like? Three pieces or six pieces? I'm gonna do three pieces. Three pieces. I'm on a food hunt today. But you have to wait. You have to wait. This one. I have to wait. Okay. All right. So you're almost finished. All right. Let's see what you have for us. So we have these flakes over here, which is fish, fish flakes. It's normal in takoyaki, right? Okay. So I got a small order of the big, big, big super takoyaki. There's one. There's two. And then here we go. Here's number three. Ah, which one are you gonna get? Oh, you're gonna give me this one. So this one, he was telling me just uh, as I was recording, he was telling me that these you don't flip, these takoyaki. So this is a really special type of... Mm. But it depends on the size of the squid. Wow, yes guys. Now you have so many different sauces. I don't know which one I want. What do you think? Mayonnaise? What is this one? Fish sauce. Fish sauce, okay. Chili sauce. Chili sauce, okay. Awesome. Mayonnaise. Mayonnaise. Oh wow, he's saucing it up. Okay, I like that. Cheese. Cheese. Okay. Wow, so many different sauces. There you have it. There we have. Let's let's see it. Okay. Awesome. Here we go. Here's the twelve ringgit. There you go. Teddy Makasi. Awesome. All right, guys. Here's the takoyaki one more time. I ended up just sitting right behind him. Sorry for all the background noise, guys. It's just how it is in these markets. But anyways, let's try out the takoyaki. Ooh, it is really hard to grab. We need to be more on an even surface. I guess let's just try out the squid by itself. Or the octopus sake. Sorry. Mmm. Very chewy. The takoyaki part, the ball part. <laughs> so tasty. I wish that lady could stop doing that bell thing. It's kind of annoying for the video. But look at these, like, these octopuses are gigantic. That's why it's called super big, big takoyaki. It's not normal takoyaki. Usually in Japan, it's a lot smaller. So good. We move on a third one real quick. Check out this guy over here has some like anime figurines and stuff as well. Naruto and whatnot. What else they have? Attack on Titan, I think. Naruto, I don't know what they have. Uh, one piece. Very noisy in these street markets, but this is how street market life is, I guess. Look at that. Oh, this looks like a gigantic bite. Let's get it. This is really good, guys. Well, that was definitely delicious. If you love takoyaki, definitely come to Malaysia. They have different variants of takoyaki, which is not the same as Japan. So takoyaki means like... Well, takoyaki, I think uh, the word means like octopus. Taco means octopus, and yaki is just like the thing that, like the bowl that it comes into. But in Malaysia, they have their own style of it, so you can get like chicken takoyaki, 
beef takoyaki, shrimp takoyaki, they have different variants of it, which is good to try. And they even have a super big, big one, which I just tried out. But that being said, we're still on the hunt to find more street food. More street food that looks interesting to me and also looks interesting to you guys. So definitely stay tuned guys and I'll show you what we end up finding. All right, so I found another food for tonight. This is called Murtabak Mini Gua Mustang. So, Assalamu Alaikum. So, can I have one order of your Murtabak Mini, please? Yeah, five minutes. Five minutes? Okay, no problem. See how he makes it. So, right now he's like opening up the dough. Uh, what is Murtabak Mini? Chicken, onion, and potato. Chicken, onion, and potato. Okay, sounds delicious. So there's different types? No, 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 just one. Just one type, okay. There's only chicken. So over here, this is the chicken? Yeah. Okay. Let's look how you guys doing it. And he's folding it up. More tabak mini. I had the big more tabak, but I never had the little mini version. It's interesting. And how long have you been doing this for? Two, three years. Two, three years, okay. Nice. Always in Kuala Lumpur? Yeah. Oh, more tabak mini, guys. And what does Gua Mustang mean? It's Gua Mustang. They just speak in Kelantan. Uh, so this is originally from uh, Kelantan? Kelantan, yeah. Kelantan, Malaysia, okay. The northeastern part of Malaysia. Yeah. Okay. Look at this, guys. You just hear it sizzling, the oil. Wow, it looks so good. Nice. I love to try out different types of uh, Malaysian food. Yeah, that's good. There's uh, laksa in front. Laksa? Yeah, I, I tried out laksa before, yeah. But today I want to try your Murtabak Mini. Look at this guy, it's sizzling, putting more oil on that. Awesome. So he was telling me he just takes the chicken breast part and then you grind it, right? Yes. Along with potato and onion. Along with potato and onions, and then okay. We cook it for like two hours. Oh, you cook it for it? You pre cook yeah, it? And oh. Then, and then we keep it in the, in the freezer. So when we're about to cook, then we bring it out. Wow. We it again. So this is actually cooked. This is cooked for two hours before, yeah, yeah. wow, and then they put so it in the freezer. We just, cook, uh, we just want to cook the dough. Nice. And it comes out crispy. And then this is the end result. And I'm getting the, I guess I'm going to go with the six pieces for five ringgit. See, they give you a deal. If you do the 13 ringgit, I'm sorry, if you do it for 10 ringgit, you get extra one. This just needs to dry out for a little bit. A little bit, just to, you know, cool down a bit. And then I will see once it cools down. Okay, it looks like it already cooled down already. Not yet. Let me give it another five minutes. Another five minutes to cool down? Okay. Yeah. Thank you, Tari Makasi. Right, thank you. Okay, and here is this. I think this is, I don't know, let me see how much. Is that five? Is that five? Okay. Thank you guys so much. Okay, thank you. So here's the Murtabak Mini. Let me take it out of the bag real quick just to show you how it is. And let's give it a... Taste test too. That's really gooey. Okay, guys, here we go. Here's a Murtabak Mini. So it actually broke a little bit apart in the bag, but let's give it a try. As always, Misuna. Mm -hmm. Straight off the bat, I'm hitting a spicy chicken, the onions, and potatoes. It's a little bit crispy, but also soft. So they, they didn't make it crispy, if you've seen the video, but unfortunately since it's been in the bag for a few minutes, the bag, you know, has all like the stuff inside of the steam and stuff, so I made it a little bit less crispier, but it's really good. Definitely give uh, Murtabak Mini a try if you're ever here in the Saturday market in Kuala Lumpur. Okay, so I still have a little bit more. I'm definitely going to eat this Murtabak Mini later on, but that being said, guys, I'm trying to think what's the next food I should eat for today. There's a lot of different choices here. 
And it looks like some people are starting to pack up, unfortunately. Which I don't know why. They should just stay here. But yeah, but also I just want to show you guys real quick, just in case if you've never seen one of my videos. They sell scarves over here. They don't just sell food in this kind of market. They also have sports jerseys over here. Oh, look at this guy over here. The wheelchair. He also has some things. Let me just... Uh, let me give him some money to donate. Here, brother. Assalamu alaikum. He's playing some Quran. Some holy verses of the Quran. Oh, look at this. What is this? Looks like this lady is making some something over here. Let me see how she's what she's doing. Maybe uh, this will be the next food. Well, what, what is this? It's Panera. It's like a dessert. A dessert? Yeah, it's made from palm sugar with flour. Rice flour. Is this all Malaysian dessert? Yes. Okay, awesome. And how much is like one? Uh, you sell it, uh, 20 pieces, 3 ringgit. 20 pieces, 3 ringgit. Okay, yes. awesome. They're like little mini, it looks like mini donuts. Yes. Wow, look at this, guys. Okay, I'm definitely gonna have to get one order, but first I wanna see how you make it. So you need to wait like 10, 10 minutes. 10 minutes? Yes. Can I wait seven minutes? Is okay? Uh, uh, <laughs> no, I'm just joking. <laughs> I just wanna see how you make it. Alright. Alright, guys. So basically, look, you guys can see how she's doing it. It's like these little mini donuts. She's cutting out, and then the extra batch, you can see she's putting in the back, and then the extra, I guess the extra, she just makes another whole batch of donuts. And is this from Kuala Lumpur? What part of Malaysia is this from? Uh, in this desert? Yeah. Uh, almost, almost every state got this. Every state got it. Uh, yes. But it's not a specific area from yeah, no. Malaysia? But originally, I think from Kedah. Kedah? Yes. Okay. So shout out to my Kedah friends. <laughs> Oh, awesome. It looks yummy. Yeah. It's sweet. It's, it's sweet. sweet. Looks like, to me, it looks like mini fried donuts. <laughs> but it tastes different. Tastes different, okay. See, look at the big crowd. Big crowd, hello. How's it going? Big crowd of people. So, it must be delicious if you have a lot of people here. <laughs> Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah, yeah. So, how many of these do you sell an hour? Five thousand pieces. Five thousand pieces. Wow. And how, how long have you been in Kuala Lumpur for? More than three years, I guess. More than three years. Okay. Are you are you the boss lady? Yeah, yeah. Oh, you're the boss. Okay. And what is this called? Let me see. Mini Mini Paneram. So if you guys ever come to the Saturday market here in Kuala Lumpur, come to Mini Paneram. And that being said, guys, I'm gonna wait for a little bit because there's a big queue. And uh, as you can see. I'm gonna wait until they finish frying the donuts and then I'll let you guys know how it is. So guys, as I'm waiting for my mini penne ram, I will show you how she reuses the dough. She puts oil on it and then she reuses it. Then she makes a big slab as we just saw previously. Oh, there we go. Flattening out. So nice to see how people make food. Okay guys, now we are going to wait for it to finish. Alright guys, mine is almost finished. Did have to wait a few minutes, but I think it's well worth the while. Look at these. Mmm, looks so good. Here's the rack over here because it's a lot of oil. So they first put it from there to here and then there. This is mine? Awesome, terima kasih. And let me pay you. There you go. Thank you so much. Okay, I'll see. I wanna sit over there. Is that fine? Okay. Actually, it started to rain, guys, a little bit. But let's go inside. Here we go, guys. Here's one of them. It's a little mini donut. <laughs> Crispy, sugary, doughy, delicious. It had to be one of the longest street foods out of the way. Wait for 10 minutes, but I think it was well worth it, to be honest with you guys. 
Never had it before. Let me know if you had it before and you think it's tasty. I have one more. Very hot. So it kind of reminds me like they're really crispy. Kind of reminds me of like a cereal, like a hot cereal. I don't know what. For some reason I think I had milk. If I like dip this in milk, it would be perfect. It's kind of like a cookie. Now I know why people will line up in line for this. I have one more. Definitely give these a try. Free ever in Kuala Lumpur. That being said, guys, I'm gonna finish this up and I'll see you in the next shot. All right, just finished from that, guys. Now time to leave the booth. I'm gonna go back. Huh? When, go back. when I go back? Now I'm gonna go back. <laughs> huh? Buy again, again. Buy again, inshallah, I'll buy again, again. Is this your mother? No, 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 no. no. Oh, it's oh friend. Oh. It's really good. Huh? Really good. No. <laughs> All right, Tani Mikasi, thank you again. Yeah, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. So this guy, guys, this guy is from Sabah, Kota Kinabalu. So should I go to Kota Kinabalu? Yes, you should. All right. Inshallah, I plan on coming to it. That's the east side of Malaysia, guys. Malaysia is cut up in two pieces. He lives in the east part. All right, very nice to meet you, brother. Salam alaikum. Can I have a selfie? Huh? Yeah, yeah, no problem. Yeah, yeah, we can take a selfie. Why not? Jump to that TV. Next time you should visit Sabah. Inshallah, why not? All right. All right. Awesome, nice to meet you guys. One more time. Bye-bye. Take, Take care. Take care. Nice you too. Day. Have fun. Uh, this is really good. <laughs> yes, I like good. it. Mini Ram. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. Meeting some nice viewers of the channel, guys. If you haven't subscribed, please do and like it as well. <laughs> Helps me just to share the videos around the world. Show your culture if you're Malaysian. If you're not Malaysian, also just to show the Malaysian culture. It's always great. Oh, we got some corn dogs over here, guys. And it is starting to rain, unfortunately, but it's okay because I am going to finish the video over here. This is a little bit of a shorter video, guys. Oh, pineapple looks really nice. These guys, hello. There's a little parking structure over here, too. So I'm at the Saturday market here in Kuala Lumpur, just in case if you guys don't know. I didn't mention it before in many videos and also this video I didn't mention it. We're right next to Sogo uh, Mall, which is right over there. And then also we're next to Meshed India, which is right over there too. So if you're wondering where this is at, this is where it's at. That being said, guys, take off my glasses because it's raining and my glasses are getting wet. Uh, I hope you enjoyed the video. As always, smash the like button and subscribe if you haven't already. If you want to see more videos around the world, you know what to do. But that being said, I also want to give a big shout out to my channel members. Right now, I think I have only one channel member. Shout out to Bruce Wayne. And shout out to you if you become part of the channel. It only costs, uh, costs of a cup of coffee per month. That really helps me out to record a lot of videos for you guys. Also, you know, supports me, supports the channel. That being said, guys, I wish you the best. And check out up on the screen to see more videos online. Peace, and I'll see you on another one. Take care.